Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Graham Cracker J. You are watching Graham Cracker J TV live on airplane mode. Basically, to me, what airplane mode means is keeping to myself, just doing things that make me happy and my daughter happy. I'm about to take a shower. I got these bath bombs off of Etsy. This one right here says it's for the heart chakra. This is supposed to have a rose quartz crystal within it. It came in a package like this. Isn't that cute? And I love the sound of it. <laughs> this is the throat chakra bath salt. I'm saging my bathroom before I take my shower and then I hop into my bath because <laughs> y'all I need all of the good energies. Cleanse y'all space too. <laughs> before I get into the shower I'm going to put my teeth whitener on. This is the whitener. <laughs> My upstairs neighbors are moving out. I'm so excited. So excited. Um, I've been having trouble with the upstairs neighbors. And I know if y'all hear that crinkling up the stairs, y'all know what I've been going through. <laughs> There's a couple times where I got woken up by my neighbors and it was because their daughter's room is right above my room. I woke up and I felt like I had a heart attack. My picture frames were jiggling on the wall. It seriously felt like she was just jumping on a trampoline upstairs. Like it was just that bad. And, <laughs> and so I had got my broom out. Cause you know us downstairs neighbors, if y'all are downstairs neighbor, y'all understand. And I started banging the ceiling because it was 10 o'clock at night and your child should be asleep, okay? Your child needs to be asleep. It was a weekday, I gotta work in the morning. Put your kid to sleep, please. Be responsible, I get it. You wanna sit here and do your own thing and kind of just pretend like the kids ain't there, but guess what they are. I walk through my apartment. Now, my daughter's room is under the baby's room. And you know how we know that? Cause the baby cries all night. And my room is under the four-year-old room. And how do I know that? Because of the way she sounds. She'll literally run back and forth, back and forth to her room. And <laughs> it's just a lot, right? So I'm here with my broom. I'm mad. My heart is racing. And I'm looking at picture frames jiggling off the wall. And I'm like, <sighs> so... I go around the house. Now, mind you, like I said, my daughter's room is the room that their baby sleeps in, okay? So I start off with the kitchen. I start banging to the beat of jingle bells, y'all. Jingle bells, all right? So I'm like, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. I'm pissed, I'm mad. First off, I didn't feel good at all. I was tired, I went to bed early. I did, but I woke up with the worst attitude. So I'm going through the house. I start with the kitchen. Jingle bell, jingle bell. Then I go to the living room. I do the diameter of the living room. Do, 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 do. Right? I should have got the Swiffer too. Because man, I would have been like da, 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 da. That's for next time. <laughs> but hey, look, they're moving out. They're moving out. This is like their last day being in this apartment. So I'm going to have some peace and quiet until the next person comes. But you never know. So I get done with the living room. I go to my room and I give it all hell. And then I hear two stops. Doom, doom, doom. I'm like, oh, you want to play games? You want to play games? I was trying to spare you. I was trying to spare you. But then I went into my daughter's room. She's knocked out. And I bang like hell on that wall. Doom, 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 doom. 
in this point, it's not Jingle Bells anymore. <laughs> it's Silent Night. So I'm like, Silent Night, Holy Night, you know. All is calm. And I start speeding up. All is bright. And I hear the baby wake up. The baby starts crying. I'm like. And within five minutes, that little girl upstairs was quiet. I got my rest. And I haven't really heard anything past nine o'clock after that. It's been quiet. But it is what it is. All right. Ooh. Y'all, it smells like toothpaste. It smells like radiant mint, y'all. It smells good. That's just my nails. Smell it. Y'all like that? <laughs> Look at me doing all the ASMR tricks. Oh my gosh, it smells delicious. I don't know how some people take baths without taking a shower before because it just grosses me out. Like you're literally sitting in your own filth. Like it's a no for me. I brought a couple candles in my bathroom because I'm really sensitive to light right now. My head has been killing me. I was out too late last night. We went bowling and uh, the lights and the flickers and all of that. Sorry, that was me, y'all. That was me. Okay. <laughs> the lights and the flickers just gave me a mad headache. Be really careful if you guys are like very sensitive to lights because when you go into like a bowling alley with like all the lights and the cosmic and blah 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 like that really will leave you hurting the next day i got a couple candles and i'm gonna take my bath in the dark just to relax and put some calming music on Y'all, that bath bomb was amazing. Getting ready to paint. I have to open up my new brushes, put them in some water. Y'all, look. It's resillable. That is awesome. Well, I have my Oracle deck here. And I'm going to choose some cards for y'all. This is number four. Any of these cards pop out on you or you're like, oh, I, I feel something when I see this card, hit me up on my Instagram or my Snapchat. They're both the same username. It'll be right here. <laughs> Ooh.
This one's really pretty. So this one's number 39. This one's number 10. Ah, uh, looks like a bookworm. This is giving me some Virgo energy or some Scorpio energy. But yeah, so number 10. I think I'm gonna do one more. Ooh, this one's really pretty. I've never seen this one out of this deck. to look at the cards and I'm going to choose one card and this one right here has stood out to me and that is number 31 oh my goodness a lot of our cards are in the 30s right now so I'm going to show you all the cards one more time This one's number four, number 39. I'm getting Aries energy from this one. And this one's number 10. That's number 30. They're moving out upstairs. They're moving out upstairs. <laughs> Y'all hear that? It's the stomping. Y'all literally can hear my oven rattle because of the people upstairs. But here is the last one. She's pretty. This one really stood out to me because of the keys. See her? She's got the keys. She's got all of that. She's got a locket right here. Now to my painting. I have a little setup here. It's not the best, but I'm working with what I have and I really, 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 really want to paint. This is my buddy. He's an eraser. I got him for my birthday. Oh, I love Harry Potter. gonna air fry some orange chicken and I have some white rice on the stove I'm excited I just went to the mail got my package Ooh. Look, okay I got this off of Amazon and then we've got the matching pants matching sweats with this so I like that Amazon came through quick I just got Amazon Prime I accidentally got Amazon Prime let me tell you I'm a little frustrated with Amazon because whenever you go to check out 
anything on Amazon, it'll have it to where you have to click off of certain things. It automatically clicks me to like do $10 next day shipping. And I'm like, I don't want that. I don't mind getting my packages slower, but I hate having to undo buttons. Like I, if I wanted to get that done, I would be like, oh, well, let me select this to get this done. Why does it automatically select that? I hate that. And I accidentally signed up for Prime. I accidentally signed up for Prime. So I'm going to use it until the end of this month is up. I'm going to see how it is. If I like it, I'll end up keeping it. But it's $12.99 a month. And I'm actually really enjoying Amazon video. So good, y'all. What's up? I uh, no, I'm not sharing. I'm sorry to say that this is not the movie you will be watching. <laughs> the movie you are about to see is extremely unpleasant. And this is what my daughter was doing while I was painting. She was painting herself. See the mountains, y'all? Isn't it so pretty? Yes, I changed my shirt again. <laughs> I've changed my shirt a couple times. Don't worry, I'm not wasting anything. I actually hung them back up because I'm really not wearing them too long. But <laughs> I got comfy and cozy and I am ready to enjoy. My daughter found the Adams Family, so we're watching that together. And I'm also editing during that time. Leave down in the comments below, what do you do when you just need to take time for yourself? Do you call it ghosting? What do you do? You, you call it me time? Some people call it different things. For me, I call it going ghost, I call it going MIA, I call it taking a hiatus. When I need to go, I need to go. I need to be able to go without having to explain to people, hey look, I'm doing my own thing, I'm out, right? Enjoying myself, just doing my own thing. And <laughs> I hope y'all liked my painting. I really tried to do a sunset, hopefully y'all can see that that was what it was. I'm not the greatest painter, but I do try. Painting really calms me down. It's very soothing. Thank y'all so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment and hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time I post. And I will see y'all later.